YouTube and welcome to lesson one of the Microsoft PowerPoint tutorial series and today we're going to look at the interface of the Microsoft PowerPoint itself. So this is the starting window of Microsoft PowerPoint and you can actually see that now I can actually start up with a lot of um, templates right there. So for ease I'm going to start up with uh, the uh, start and outline um, slide right here which is actually helpful if you want a template to start uh, your topic with. So I'm going to click this out right here. I'm going to double click this out and you can see that you can actually search for topics which uh, is related with your slide. So in my case, I'm going to type in animation because that is my specialization. Let's search it out and it will search through the internet library for animation related slides. So you can see that the animation is a, a topic over there. So I'm just going to click on that. And you can see that you can actually select the type of animation um, um, topics you can actually have the, over there. So I'm going to disable this one. I'm going to disable awards. I'm going to have animation in human rights history. I want it. I want the techniques and so forth. And I can simply click on next. So I can pick a look out there. So it is actually looking at the different uh, type of slides that are available over here. So I can choose from the template I want. So you can see that this looks quite interesting and I can simply click create. So if you want uh, everything uh, formatted for you and quickly want to get away with slide making, then this might probably uh, be the one for you. So actually it is starting up my Camtasia and let me close that out. And you can see that I have the uh, PowerPoint slide ready over there. So you can see that uh, this is where the title goes in. So you can actually just select it and type it out. So if you are familiar with Microsoft Microsoft Word, then you um, are actually quite familiar with PowerPoint already. So you can see that these are the topics over here. So on the left side, you can actually see that these are the number of slides I have. So you got that uh, animator right here, criticism and works cited and so forth. You can also use the arrow keys to navigate over here, as you can see. And over here at the top, you see the uh, quick um, so quick menu. So uh, things like save, undo, and uh, present the slide. So is actually available over there as well. So over here at the top, there's the menu as you can see. So you got the file menu. That's the main menu right there. And there's home insert where you can actually uh, insert different objects into the PowerPoint slide. There's design over here where you can choose different um, style for the slide as you can see over here. There's different transitions. So you want to add transition to the slides, then you can choose it from here. You can add in different animations from this tab over here. Go to slide so you present the slide so from current slide from the beginning from over here. You can also review it out, change the language settings and correct the spellings from this slide. You can go to view different type of view slides. So you can actually go for slide sorter view. You can see that different view styles is actually available over here. You can go for add-ins over here. You can also even record it out in my, uh, Microsoft PowerPoint. And then you can also uh, go to the help menu. And there's the tell me assistant over here. And if you're, you already have seen my Microsoft Word, Power, um, uh, Word tutorial, then you might be familiar with this. And things are quite similar over here as well, since it is from Microsoft as well. So over here, uh, this is the ribbon, as you can see, that if I were to go into some section and click on some section, you can see that extra ribbon actually appears over here, like format and so forth. So I can actually um, uh, minimize this as well, collapse the ribbon over here by clicking this arrow over here. And you can see that once I click it, the ribbon actually pops up. And if I want to actually uh, collapse it out again, so you can see that you can click it and click on the spin icon to get that back in place just like that. So you can also uh, go for uh, more options over here. Let's say, for example, I want to uh, change, make changes to the drawing over here. You can go to format option over here and you can even navigate to more option over here uh, just like that. So you can go for more option over here and we are going to uh, look at all of these in details um, in future lessons. So this is just a quick overview of the overall uh, software over there. Over here at the bottom is the notes uh, of the PowerPoint. Uh, you can see that you can also click this to enable and disable the note. This is the status bar. It will actually show you on, uh, that the slide number that you're in and so forth and the language setting and everything else. You can also go to the presentation slide from over here. You can also zoom in and out of the 
uh, objects uh, just like that and that is how the animation um, that is how the uh, PowerPoint slides um, uh, slides are controlled so this has been the um, overview of the PowerPoint uh, software itself the interface so we'll continuing on by creating animations and so forth so hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe